Here with Italian and LaMonica from Designated Survivor. I love this show. I'm not just saying it. I, like, wait for Wednesdays to watch it. But my question is, what can we expect from a second season? LaMonica? I'll take this one. <laughs> um, we have no idea. We haven't seen any scripts yet, so we just know it's going to be exciting. It's going to be a thrill ride, and we can't wait to see it, just like you. <laughs> so you're now the chief of staff, or your character is. Uh, what can we expect from her? Like, is she going to make a play for more power, or do you feel like she's sort of good being sort of uh, the second person in charge? I have no idea. I really, I truly don't. Maybe, maybe she'll run for VP. That would be fun. Yes. I have no idea, but anything's possible on this show. Monica, what is it like uh, working with Kiefer? Um, you know, like he has such a strong presence. He's known for so many different things. What is he like on set? He's a consummate professional. He shows up. He knows his stuff. He's uh, He sees things that I don't see and that other actors don't see. He's just been doing it for so long. It's really, you trust him. Like his instincts are like through the roof and you trust that. You know, you know what I'm the most happy about? That we don't have to hear that one guy's name. I thought it was the most irritating name on TV. Yes. Oh, McLeish. <laughs> my skin is... Did they purposely name him that so we'd all hate him? Well, they were sort of supposed to be a play on um, Lady and Macbeth. Oh, I never even thought about that. Yes. Um, you know. It's true. It's true. And finally, like, the reason I like the show so much is there was a twist almost every single week. Can we expect more of the same next season? I would assume so. I mean, if it ain't broke, right? Yeah. More of a thrill ride. Guys, thank you so much. So nice to meet you. So nice to meet you.